Well, all right, Jonathan, so I'm this tonight, but uh, you're t through two NBA games, what are your uh, your first impressions? You know, it's, it's a nice game. And, uh, you know, it's important that we win. That's the most important. The team is happy. Everyone's happy. Two row games in a row. I mean, I don't think that's like a lot of people expect that from us. And that just shows we didn't play good even today. You know, that shows how potential we're holding still. You know, and I think we can, we can do really good this year. What are your goals personally um, for the season? I mean, getting the rotation. Getting the rotation. Try to fight for a place on the court. That's my goal. So, you know, I'm just sitting away my chance. That's all I can do. You know, working like uh, for, we try to work, work as hard as I can work, you know, behind everyone and try to fight for my place. And what do you think your place is on this team? I will see. You need to ask for a coach. He knows better, you know. For now, I try to support everyone. You know, have a hard time you know, on the court. I try to just help them. And um, with the uh, European Championships coming up this summer, do you have uh, any interest in playing um, for Lithuania after being left off the last two squads? You know, a lot, some, something changed in the national team. I mean, I didn't talk with the coach. After I talk, we'll see if there should change something else or no. You know. it's, I mean, it's, we'll see. You know, it was, there was some weird things going on inside of the national team. And, you know, I don't want to be a part of the, like something, you know, like politics. I don't want to be a part of just going every time, giving my best, you know, and someone not appreciate what I'm doing, you know, I don't see a point to go there and play. You know. Do you think it motivated you not making the last two teams? Yeah, of course. Motivated. I mean, that's, that's the thing that, you know, I have in my life. There's not even one time that I had that all the time straight road that someone gave me opportunities. I was fighting through everything, you know. I think that, put me, that gave me a lot of anger and a lot of good anger to work extra and to push myself to the limits, you know, as much as possible. I mean, it seemed to all of us watching the EuroLeague last year that when you were with ProCom, you were a different player, a much more aggressive player, a much more assertive player. Um, that was from last summer into the, into the next season. Do you think in this past summer you've made similar steps forward and gotten gotten the, uh, the same was, sort of improvements? I was working every day hard as hell. You know, and, uh, all the time I would have coaches working around me who was helping me a lot. So I, I expect that I have a big step forward, you know. Just so like I said, I need to wait my chance, my chance will come, I'm sure I will take it. You know. And when you, when you say politics as far as going back to the Lithuanian team, um, I, what, just, I just won't leave it that way, you know. The people who understand basketball knows more than I need to tell anything, you know. That's, that's how it is. I never give interview for, for them, you know, for uh, no journalist after them. They kick me out, they kick me out, and want to go in that, in that spot, you know. I just, the, the smart people, they understand what's going on, what's happening. You know, it's, I never didn't go to national team because I didn't want to. I was made to go, you know. It is how it is. You know? Yeah. Just telling you, right now, it's going to be the new coach, you know. Hopefully, new people are working in the federation. Hopefully, they will change, they change the station, at least minimum, you know. Yeah. Because all my life, you know, I'm working to play in the national team. That's my biggest dream, too. And it's not that, you know, it's something that I don't want to do. So, you say your biggest dreams, national team, and NBA? Yeah, that's, that's the thing, yeah. And you've gotten one. So, what do you need to do to make the other? Or, or just like you said, politics. Hard Carter? All right, Donatasa. And lastly, how is it playing with um, Harden and Lynn these first couple of games? All, all the buzz around them. I mean, we didn't have a really big chance to play against them, but they're pretty good guys. They're smart, you know, they understand basketball. It's a pleasure to play with them, you know. It's a pleasure really to play. And I'm, I'm happy that I have a chance to play with these guys. Maybe in the future, if I will not be a good player, you know, I will tell my kids that <laughs> yeah, I play with them, you know. I had a chance to press their hands. But uh, hopefully, it will not happen like that. All right, Don, it does. Good luck, man. Thanks.